guys I got my hair pressed laid smoothed like what of course so the reason why I got my hair done and I straightened it it was because it was my 21st birthday on the 11th of this month and I wanted something different I haven't straightened my hair in a really really long time and I wanted to see it so I went and did that you guys have always really wanted to see my hair straight and see how it looks and all that stuff so I wanted to show you guys how it looked even though I didn't do it myself so I went to get it done and I decided to kind of do like a vlog style video to show you guys the process and everything that they did at the salon and all that good stuff. I do some pep prepping before I actually go to the hair salon because I go to the Dominican hair salon to do my hair and honestly they don't know how to deal with really curly hair and it can be really damaging to your hair if they are just really rough with it. So there are stuff that I do before I go to the hair salon so it's just much easier and the process goes much smoother and everything is just much better in the end like that so basically that's what this video is going to be today and I'm just get right now. okay so before I go to the hair salon the first thing that I do the night before I go I usually go to the hair salon in the morning this time though I had to wait till after my classes to go I usually wash my hair myself and I wash my scalp really really well about three times like they do at the actual hair salon and then when I'm finished with that I deep condition my hair and I deep condition my hair overnight so I would go to the hair salon in the morning with the deep conditioner in my hair so they can wash it out. So the deep conditioner that I'm using right now is a deep treatment mask with sea kelp and argan oil from Shea Moisture. So I put that all in my hair and after that I start detangling my entire hair. So I take it out in sections and I really detangle it and do it nice and then I use a demon brush so it's really smooth. After I smooth all the conditioner into my hair and all my hair is detangled, that's when I twist it into um, a style that I can wear to the hair salon or in this case that I can actually wear to my classes so I don't look crazy but I still have that conditioner working into my hair for the entire day until I actually go to the hair salon. So basically what I did this time was I twisted my hair, um, just did two big twists and then I wore a hat and my hood and that was me throughout my classes, honestly. I just did that. I even wrapped my hair in a scarf just so it can keep the conditioner really in and from the cold air and all that good stuff. And then I got to the hair salon and what they did was they actually deep conditioned it again and I sat under the dryer and it so it can work into my hair and then they just washed it out and then that's when they started rolling my hair into the roller set. I personally don't agree with um, blow drying your hair right after you wash it. Now going from that very drenched wet curls to that, that method that they use of breaking the brush through your hair and pulling is so bad for your hair so make sure even though you have curly hair to ask for the rolling set so your hair can just sit and dry and set nicely you're still gonna have heat on your hair but it's gonna be much better for your hair I promise you that so I always get my hair rolling set so it can dry under the hood dryer then they blow dry it how they blow dry with the brush and the blow dryer and then after that she went with the flat iron and just did one pass the entire my all my hair to get that really nice smooth look and then after that she clipped my ends and she got a really nice cut and then smoothed it smoothed it down with some oil and that was pretty much it That's how it looks in the front <laughs> at night what I do is I just wrap my hair regularly and tie it in the scarf I don't do anything else and then I brush it down. Alternate my wraps every night just because one side, if you keep doing it to one side, it can kind of thin out. So yeah, that was basically it. I am really happy with the way it came out. If you want to get your hair done and you kind of wasn't feeling it, kind of feel a little bit better and know what to do to prep for it and not being afraid to tell them how to deal with your hair. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope you guys like my hair straight. Let me know if you guys like my hair straight. Let me know. Do you like it better straight or curly? I like both. Honestly, I love both. When I do straighten it, because I don't straighten it often, I'll be like, I'm myself. I'm feeling myself. I'm feeling I'll be feeling myself too much. But I love my hair both ways. <laughs> then make sure you give this video a really big thumbs up. If you're new to my channel and you like what you're seeing, subscribe and share this video. And yeah, that's basically it. I hope you have an amazing day and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!